brain-eating amoeba. That's scary and interesting at the same time. What is this amoeba? Where do you think it was first discovered? Discovered in Australia in 1965, but it's believed to have evolved in the United States. Its scientific name is Nigleria phalari. It loves warm water. It can survive in water as hot as 113 degrees Fahrenheit. It's found in warm places, mud puddles, warm, slow-flowing rivers, untreated swimming pools, and even in soil. However, it can't live in salt water or in properly treated swimming pools. Nigleria phalari normally eats bacteria, but if it gets into humans through the nose, it uses the brain as a food source. Activities like diving, water sports, water skiing, in which water is forced into the nose, increase the risk of infection. Fortunately, it doesn't transmit from an infected person to another person. Now, you might be thinking, how the hell does this amoeba find its way to the brain? Well, it's just smart, you know. It has a good understanding of the human anatomy. Jokes aside, it is attracted by the chemicals secreted by the nerve cells of the olfactory nerve. It travels through the olfactory nerve and enters the frontal lobe of the brain. It takes 2 to 15 days for symptoms to appear after the amoeba enters the nose. Symptoms are fever, headache, stiff neck, and sometimes seizures. Unfortunately, there's no good treatment option yet for this disease. It all sounds scary, but you can protect yourself. The easiest thing to do, keep your head above water or wear nose plugs. Also, try to skip swimming in lakes and rivers when it's really hot outside. The amoeba thrives in warm water. Nigleria phalari trophozoites isolated from the cerebrospinal fluid, or CSF, of a patient with primary amoebic meningoencephalitis are seen with phase contrast microscopy at 600 times magnification. The amoebae are seen moving in a sinuous fashion at about 10 times their normal speed. Hope you liked our video. Share this information with your loved ones. And don't forget to subscribe to our channel. Thank you.